going on, y'all? Am I certainly excited to share with you the new incubator here. Uh, this unit is going to be an asset here for a small-time sideliner. And the idea of using the incubator is to allow me to be more frequent with my queen grafting. So right now the idea is I can go out to my bee yard, I can take my uh, grafting frame out. I have 20 cap queen cells right now. Today is day eight. Uh, my last video, I had an early queen that emerged and tore all the other queens down. So to prevent that, uh, you can see we have these roller cages. I can now take all 20 queen cells, put them all into roller cages, keep them in the incubator so they stay warm. I can also start another round of grafts and then I'll transport the, the queen cells from this incubator to the bee yards uh, when I make my splits. I'll show you more on how I'm gonna transport uh, the, the cells. If I wanted to, I could plug this unit right into the uh, car adapter lighter. Might just do that, but the idea or the purpose of this incubator is I want to every week continually take cells out of my grafting frame put them into here so I can start another round of graphs and do that every single week. If I can do that with two builders at a time and do two rounds of graphs at, you know, every single week, then the more the merrier. Um, but I do not plan on waiting the full 16 days. I'd rather uh, introduce queen cells uh, rather than wait for virgin queens uh, to, to make new splits. So more on that later. Uh, stay tuned and good luck with your bees.